Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are taking a look here at Azure Defender. So Azure Defender provides advanced protection for your Azure and on-premise workloads, and Azure Defender can be found in the Azure Security Center. So within the Security Center, there'll be a tab called Azure Defender, and that's the way you find it. So Azure Defender is composed of coverage, security alerts, insights, and advanced protection. So talking about coverage, it allows you to see the resource types that are in your subscription and eligible for protection by Azure Defender. So here, take note that that we can see things like virtual machines, Kubernetes services, container registry, app services, SQL uh, VMs, vault, uh, uh, key vaults, SQL servers, and storage accounts. For security alerts, they describe details of the affected resources, such as remediation steps, and in some cases, an option to trigger a logic app in response. So here you can kind of see security alerts over time. Uh, then there are insights. This is a rolling pane of news, suggested reading, and high priority alerts uh, that give security centers insights into pressing security matters that are relevant to you and your subscription. For advanced protection, within Defender are additional security features that is driven by analytics, so VM vulnerability assessments, just-in-time VM access, adaptive application control, container image scanning, adaptive network hardening, SQL vulnerability assessment, file integrity monitoring, network map, IoT security, and so down below, you can see all these options here, whether they're turned on or not. Let's take a, we'll take a look at network map here in a moment. Um, so scope of Azure Defender. So there, it has a lot of different plans for specific Azure resources. So we have Azure Defender for servers, app service, storage, SQL, Kubernetes, container registry, key vault, resource manager, DNS, uh, open source relational databases. And when you turn on Azure Defender, all plans are activated. We saw that under the advanced protection uh, tabs. Then just to kind of highlight network map, because this one's really cool, uh, it's a network map that provides a grapple, graphical view with, with security overlays giving you recommendations and insights for hardening your network resources. So uh, using the map, you can see the network topology of your Azure workloads, uh, connections between your virtual machines and subnets, and the capabilities to drill down from the map into a specific resource uh, resources and the recommendations of those resources. Uh, then just the last thing I want to touch on here is hybrid uh, cloud protection. So Azure Defender can protect VMs residing in other cloud service providers such as AWS and GCP via Azure Arc. So Azure Arc, if you've never heard of it, is a control plane that uh, can manage compute resources across cloud service providers on premise and at the stage uh, or at the edge. And so for infrastructure, you'll notice that it can handle uh, VMs, uh, Kubernetes clusters, SQL servers, and Azure Stack HCIs.